Moop Moop. Moop Moop. Scribble's a juggalo. And um, yes, my hands are dirty because I paint. I work. 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 I work every day and I work hard every day. And it's lame. And it sucks. But, but we do what we have to do. Now recently, I'm going to say this. I'm very tired. You're very tired. He's just kidding up. I've been up an hour. 30 minutes. Recently. You bought yourself an energy drink, but you didn't get me one. Well, that's because you, did, you lately, you haven't been into them lately. Well, into them. I'll, I'll run across this fucking street and get you one. Now listen. Let me make my point here. I don't want this to be like 15 minutes. Recently. See, point. Point. Look at the different background. <coughs> It looks like a halo. It's not a halo. It's a fucking light. Uh, it looks like a fucking something. Um, looks like I'm, my hair is on fire. You do. You have very fiery hair. Well, it's a different background because we got kicked out. I'm gonna say this because it's no big secret. <coughs> we got kicked out of our situation we were in. <coughs> It is a monthly situation. Uh, it's technically it's a motel, but they <laughs> a but, weekly motel. Well, we've lived there for quite a while because we turned. They have weekly and monthly. The last one we were, at, we were there for about two and a half years. We we're there for two and a half years. We they have weekly and monthly rentals that that we fixed up pretty cool. I we painted it. We had posters. Painted posters. And, and it was basically an apartment. Shit. We had our own TV. Okay. It's Let nice. me make my point. It's nice. Nah, I it's backed nice. into a fucking, into the owner's brand new Mercedes about a month ago because I drive, what do we have, a, a Ford? A Ford Econoline. Econoline. Now, hey, if you've ever... Extended cab. <laughs> 350 extended cab. Extended, which means it's got three Let extra me, feet on the back end of it. Thank you for adding that. That will help. Piece Let me say this. Van. If you've ever drove one of those, it's like, it's a little hard to park and to back up. Well, especially to back up. Let's say it's not a Honda. So, when I backed into the owner's brand new 2013 Mercedes, and it was 2012 at the time, and yeah. that's how new this how did was. You get this car, right? Well, it, it raised my insurance rates, and they didn't. They just took insurance and all that because I am a legal driver, and all that. Um, I decided to finally follow the the rules. <laughs> you know, you finally learn to not speed and to get insurance and to get the a license and whatnot. All right, so. Well, it happened again <clears throat> about Not seven, about five days ago, where I backed into one of the workers' trailers, and it put a little dent in, in the thing. Literally, like this big. And they freaked I out. Hit it. I've got tools to hammer it out. I could have hammered it out myself. And there's dents all over this this trailer that they use. It's it's a, it's got to be a twenty year old trailer, right? Not to mention. Not to mention, make it um, quick, man. Like, let the, me talk this the, time. The people that are uh, <clears throat> working there wreck these things, these trailers, the constantly. And I'm not obviously I'm not in it, but I'm gonna talk anyways. Um, no, no, you are part of it. Yeah, but I'm just like not visually in it. So anyways, um, but it, it, they wreck. One of them had this did one of these. <coughs> big Pinsky truck <coughs> drove too close to the to the Something. building and literally wrecked into the building and went the entire distance. You ever seen someone pull in and hit a bridge or a fucking top of the building and they knock off the top of the fucking truck? Well, that's what this guy did, <coughs> and he did it more than once. He didn't get fired. His his own. But we got kicked pulled. out of the of the motel. It's really more like an apartment. And we didn't get a refund, which really sucks. So here, here we are. It was shocking. Lost days, uh, a day of work. <clears throat> and, and it was shocking and horrible. 
and nearly we're we're, ba we're 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 almost on the edge of being homeless. Now we're in, trying to go to the now we're in a different <laughs> situation. Now that's the point of this video. No, no, don't laugh at that because it will happen. Oh, of course. But the thing is, is it, no. Listen, it just listen. Sucks when you don't understand. You're in the middle of the shit that you that you want to do, and then you get thrown a curveball. You, you get know? thrown a very big curveball. This one fucking was coming right at you and just zip right out. And of the it way. like someone pulling the carpet out from under you, and you're on your ass. And, and that you know that's what happened to us. So now we are. Looking for an apartment. We have no steady work, but we're still going to the gathering. How do I know we're going to the gathering? Because I believe. And I keep this thing around my neck. Because and, and I and I won't take it off through showers or nothing. Because I believe that this year I will be at the gathering. And I know it's gonna happen. And you and you, people out there who want to go to it, you gotta believe. And if you believe in something, you can make it happen. And we're gonna make it happen. No matter how much shit we have to go through until August seventh, we'll be there. And and I don't know how we're gonna do it, but it will happen. And that's the point of this video. <clears throat> Why will it happen? Because I believe. Yeah. Call it God, call it whatever, yeah. whatever the fuck you want to call it. Premonition. Call it. Please give me a cigarette over there. Oh man. Call it what? Call it anything. It's not a premonition. It's I'm not gonna let this thing go, man. Yeah, we we just kind of gave up last year because. Because it was too hot. Things, but there, we have so many obstacles. And it was kind of similar. The work wasn't his, it wasn't uh, super steady. It isn't steady now. And it's so we didn't really have. It but was, we, it's more steady now. It, but we we steady. have to go because I got to be at this year's one, and um, it will happen. And I'm. And no matter what obstacles I have to go through, or you guys have to go through, if you want to go to the gathering, you can make it happen. If you want something, you can have it. If you believe. I swear to God, I've seen one person that said he had walked from some state. I don't even remember which one, but he said it was a long, long, long walk. And he had started months early. <laughs> and hitchhiked. But uh, people that leave we he sir, fucking got there. We're going and to the gathering. And, and and I don't think he had any money or anything, but he got in and he was there. I don't know how. And that's I just know I'll work. be there. That's just how things work. It's, it's like things why and why and why? Because Boondocks is gonna be there. Because Blaze well, is gonna will be it there. To happen. Most of the time you just will it to happen. Dark Lotus. Psychopathic Riders, Syncom Posse, they're all going to be there. And Scribbles, the Juggalo, me. I'm not a rapper, I'm a Juggalo. I call myself Scribbles the Juggalo because I'm just, I, I know my place. I'm just a Juggalo. That's all I am. And he's Magnet the Juggalo. Not Mag Magnet the Rapper, not Magnet the Feature Celebrity, Rapper, whatever. He's a Juggalo. Oh, he may be a millionaire someday. I, I doubt I will. I know, I know I won't be. But <clears throat> I'm older. Um, and I don't ask for much in life. <clears throat> but shelter over my head, food, um, money, a healthy body, which this isn't going to help. Um, and to go to the gathering. And, I'll be, and, I, and I don't know how it's going to happen, but we'll, we'll, we'll make it, won't we? Right? Oh, yeah. All right. And so we'll all do Period. And that's it. We'll, we'll, we're out.